Yo, what is up, everyone? Hope all's going well for you. Welcome back to Get Jack, Not Egg and Ting Off here. In Conan Exiles, we're back. Episode 2. I'm just getting back to base. I need to, like, heal up and stuff. I'm about to die. Um, do just a little farming trip here. Um, I'm gonna heal up. We're gonna try and get going on some of these higher tier building stuff. I feel bad building out of such low tier materials. Okay, so I've been working on getting... The steel reinforcements going. We need so for the highest tier, we need steel reinforcements. We need shape wood, and we need hardened brick. These bigger ones. So we're not gonna have much to work with. This is gonna be a really slow process. But I've got I forget which expansion this one was, but I really like this building like class of stuff. So I really like this. I'm gonna go with it. So it's kind of like Greek. I don't know, ish. You've got all this, like, uh, the black ice stuff, and then I've got also got this one. We'll probably incorporate some of this in, because I kind of like the, what is that, like a, not Arabian, but I don't know. Different kind of theme. Let me see here. Yeah, see, 15 of the hardened bricks, and this stuff is not cheap. You need to go through a process to get all that going. Maybe we'll go over that sometime soon, if... A bunch of you are getting into Conan or something need need some like guides on how to do stuff I don't know I, it's pretty difficult actually in this game is I don't see very many guides for Conan out so I'm just always like Wikipedia and stuff trying to figure that out so we're gonna start with like this center look at this Jer upgrade your building to the highest tier it was just one foundation settled down okay we got, we got a long way to go here to upgrade this building into it um Let's see here. If we could just start with this room, that'd be awesome. This looks really cool, especially compared to the sandstone stuff. This is pretty cheap. I mean, really cheap. It's the cheapest, obviously. And I figure we just skip the mid tier. Wait, what is this? Oh, no. Oh, no. I accidentally built fence foundations, didn't I? Why? Why do these look like walls? Okay, hold up. Alright, so that kind of sucks. <laughs> kind of used a lot of the mats on building <laughs> useless fence foundations. <laughs> Maybe I can find a use for them. I don't know. Maybe I'll just, like, put them down and destroy them. But, uh, this door looks... Yeah. This is gonna look nice. I mean, it looks weird with the sandstone. But, you know, we're, we're working with it. So I made some normal walls. This is all I could... All I could put together. We're gonna have to farm. Um, I'm kind of dismantling the wall. I could just replace it one for one, but... I'm kind of destroying the walls as I go because I'm worried they're not going to place the right way and I can't, it, it's not like I can see the words outer face when it's in the way. Um, yeah, we'll go right here. So we'll just keep, I think this, nor I was going to remove this at one point and go with like a staircase along the side, but I think this will be good actually. It's kind of like going to be like a grand spiral staircase going up because above us I think is where everything will eventually be. Oh, and this is, a uh, yeah, these are, like, the windows. So, I can ex actually access this guy through the window, so we don't even, we get, we get to bypass one entire door. Alright, I'm gonna, just gonna continue messing around with this. It's gonna take a long time to upgrade this, so that'll be an over time process. So, we'll work on it, we'll work on it. Okay, this guy should be all set. This actually is going to help a lot because those steel reinforcements take forever, <laughs> forever to craft. So he's only a level two. We got to keep our eye out for like a better one, but it's a good start. So now we can craft these quite a bit quicker. That that still looks really slow, but believe it or not, that is a lot faster than what it was doing. So uh, now at least these will pump out. These are kind of like the limiter right now because they just take so long. But I think bricks are going to be hard to keep up with, to be honest. Let's see here. I think we've got... Are you done? Almost done. So we got the the dancer almost done. And then... Ooh. Carpenter's almost done. That'll be really nice as well for, for the shape wood. But I don't know. I feel like the shape wood crafts faster. Or I guess I just haven't run out of it so far. So maybe... Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know. Either way, this is where we got left off on the building. It's not very far. <laughs> We've got an armor uh, a little two here. He's kind of preoccupied, so I don't think he's going to kill him for once. 
That's the biggest problem, is when your follower kills what you're trying to knock out. But I think we should be alright. There we go. He's, been, he's like flying through the air and stuff. Alright, I'm gonna heal up. He can take care of himself. It's only level 2 still, but I mean, like, it, like I said, with the other dude, it's a good start. We've got a lot of workbenches to fill, okay? We need a lot of these guys. You got this? Alright. Oh, he's not. He's not done. He's moving on to the next. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm just kind of like out leveling the follower because those levels do make a big difference. I'm going to bring this guy back to base, though, because it's right near here. Where is my rope? Let's get this. And let's go. Easy. Easy find. All right. We're on the river of reptiles. A reptile river they like to call it or I like to call it so these guys give ick icker itcher whatever what you know potato potato how are you thirsty we were just in a river hold up okay so it's also I think dropped by spiders but I, I it's very inconsistent with the spiders it seems like like half of them give it half of them don't uh, the other way we can get it is with the fishing traps but that's slow, and I'm sick of farming bugs for that. So, we need Icker, and these, this guy needs levels too, because he kind of sucks. So, we will just, just look at, oh no, I gained a level. I thought he gained, gained a level. So, when you harvest them, you get a decent amount. What is it? Five? I think you can get more. I feel like it's like five to like 15-ish. Oh, th there we go. Each, uh, this one was what I've been building for, so each light attack is going to do 10 percent more and that's good with the daggers because you tack really fast with those light attacks so if I get a couple things of bleed on something then I can just like light attack it down that's what I've been going for because I like the daggers I like the bleed it's good against like high enemies but see there's a ton of the that is not the right dagger I'm going to harvest your skin for me as you breathe um yeah there's a whole bunch of these guys as you can see Okay, so I only got about five, uh, 50 acre from killing all those reptiles, so it's just not going to be a good way of doing it. There must be a bigger patch of spiders or something, but I think the best way to do it is with the fishing traps. The only problem is I'll show you why. This guy, this guy spawns right below us. He's, he's hanging out down here all the time. He'll be back in like five minutes, don't you worry. So the problem is... They changed it. You used to be able to put these inside of like the w the wells, like the big wells, but they've made it so you really need to place these in water now. You could place it like anywhere in these rivers before, but I think with the expansion they changed it to fix like people like bugging it out. So I I don't think anywhere near us we can place this. That's that's the issue with the fishing traps. I keep placing them like in the deep parts further away, and they keep like decaying or getting broken by people. So. That is our issue with these. I need to find a spot. Uh, oh, ah, hey, hey, look at this. We couldn't, we can't place these. Yeah, these aren't working, but we got the, uh, the crawfish ones down, or whatever these are called. Maybe lower it down a bit, no. Why won't this work? This is perfect for fish. Look at, look at all the fish. Oh, I mean, there's kind of a sandbar. <laughs> Not this. How is this river even flow? Oh, God. Whoops. How is this river even flowing? It's a sandbar right there. I'm not going to question it. Yeah, this ain't going to work. So what we do is we put the handfuls of insects that we get from collecting fiber and stuff. We put those inside of here. It makes, or it catches the unappetizing fish. We cook said unappetizing fish in cooking equipment, and that gives us ichor. So, that is the process if we're not getting it from spiders and whatnot. Do these give handfuls of bugs? They do not. Okay, it needs a normal fiber. Can't be berry bushes. I think these are all berry bushes. Okay. 
All right, check it out. Our awesome performer's done. He's got, he's got we got matching helmets. Um, I was just finishing up getting some of these. I'm trying to get the balcony out back done. What is happening, guys? It's happening up there. You got this under control? Oh no, actually I don't want that in there. Hold up, I want those to be in there, please. Okay, you got this. How did it get in here? What are you doing? Okay. Anyway, uh, let's cook up these. Look at that. I got three. Three of them. I want to see how much each one gives. One acre. Okay. Well, it's good to know that is what it gives. But, it's going to take a lot. Alright. So, we got those rhinos when we were out and about. Two of them. And they have finished. So, with one of the expansions, the, the you get this Terranian one. So, I think... I think we need to combine it with our rhino in some way. So I did make the Terranian fodder. It was made in the fireball cauldron. And now, if we combine it with our rhino, we should get a pack rhino of some sort, I think. I We can't ride the rhino until we get the Isle of Sipta expansion. I haven't actually bought the expansion yet, so check that out. Greater Hyena. That's how, that was, I don't... Did I show you getting a hyena? Either way, I got a hyena over here. The first one came out as the greater hyena, which is pretty cool. I need to take them out and like level them up. But anyway, we've got this rhino. Do we feed it? Do we maybe feed it the uh... Invent which one's inventory? Oh, my bad. Okay, so do we feed it to you? Whoops. You know what? Maybe we... Let's do this. Oh, this one is a white rhinoceros. Came out as a white rhinoceros. I think we actually craft it. Like, in here. Okay, so. White rhinoceros. There we go. I don't know what we're going to do with the other one then. I think once we get the Isle of Sipta, we can make a saddle for the other one. Oh, dude. I want to see what it looks like from the front. Oh, that looks sick. Oh, look at how much space this thing has. You can't ride it? It looks like you'd be able to ride it. I don't think you can ride it. Oh man, that looks cool. So this will be like what we have follow behind us. That hyena is looking at us over there. <laughs> this is going to be what like we have follow behind us and just load this dude up. We can load this up with so much stuff. That's sick. That's That saddle looks so comfy. Let me ride you. Huh? Well, come on. Let me up. Okay, so I am going to get the expansion because I really do want to ride the other rhino. It sounds really cool. Um, but we need a saddle workbench. This is going to be for the horses as well. So I don't know what else you can ride. I think it's just the horses and then, yeah. And then we'll have to get the rhino one from the expansion. Okay, I had to do it. I had to see what it was like. So I downloaded it, had to relog. we're all set, let's check this out. I really want to ride a rhino. Okay. I think we should be able to just make the saddle in here now. Perfect. 45 iron. Boom. We did it. Now the nice thing about the the rideable ones is you can have a rideable one and then you can also have somebody following you. So it kind of gives you like a lot more uh, carry weight basically. Uh, can I put the armor in here? You, I can. Look at it. Automatically made it faster. That's sick. Oh, that's so much faster. Nice. Perfect timing, dude. Thank you. I'm not going to leave them in there, though, because we're not going to be, like, crafting saddles all the time. Uh, let's put them in the artisan table. How's that? You, you good with being an artisan, bro? 
Can you just put any of them in any of the tables? I wonder. Well, I don't know. I guess maybe our armor is like interchange interchangeable. Okay, I think we got everybody out of their things. Let's go try this saddle out. No. Let's go try this saddle out. We got him. Oh, we could literally have we could ride this rhino and then have Pack Rhino follow us. Check it out. That looks sick, actually. Look at how he rides it. Like he's riding a bull. Uh, okay, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Let's go this way. It doesn't seem like you can attack with it. There's no, like, attack button or anything. That's unfortunate. But I oh, wait, you can, like, run into him, though. So there's no actual attack button, but... Yeah, this is, would be dangerous, dude. Oh, I think you can probably use certain weapons on the back of it. Okay, yeah, he's just stuck now. It's cool that you can ram him, but, like, you should have, like, an attack button. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let's just bring him back to the, the back side. His stam kind of runs out quick. But I think they level up as well. This is cool. This is going to be nice to be able to... Yeah, he's, he's leveling up just for me riding him. Yo, guys. F fight him off. F fight him off. E is not to dismount, evidently. I don't know how to get off this thing. Oh, wait. Wait, you can swing his... Why doesn't it tell me how to do this? You can swing his, uh... Head. Usually it tells you down in the bottom right, like, all the buttons, but... Oh, dismount to C. Okay, I gotcha. I, I'm teaching myself stuff. Look at this. Yeah, this pack rhino is awesome. Like, he can defend himself. He's pretty beefy. How many hyenas there are over here? And I'm just, like, going through here just getting so many resources. Trying to level him up too. Maybe he gets like level like uh, when he gets his level ten perk. I'm thinking maybe they get like some form of encumbrance or or maybe more slots and or something. Come on, it can't just be like attack stuff, right? On these guys. Look at this. I've got so much stone in here. I've got a hyena baby. We're gonna try with another hyena. Look at how much space it's. You can just keep it adding it. It's incredible, incredible. Um. Let's see. Have we, have we killed off all the hyenas? I'm trying to get it all the XP we can. This is like right next to our base. We've got all this stuff. You see how nicely that's coming along? But we need to get a wall around the whole backside. I don't like it like being open and whatnot. Yeah, these daggers are starting to get strong with my higher strength. Is that a mean one? Oh no. This is like a bad one. Just trying to get as much bleed as we can into it. Oh, okay. The hyenas aren't too terrible, I guess. Wow, I'm getting a lot stronger. These used to be, like, super hard, dude. Give me something good. Give me something good. Potion of natural learning? That's awesome. So that gives me more, like... Oh, nice. Experience and stuff. Awesome. Yeah, those always give you, like, something cool when you harvest them. It's weird that it's not in their inventory like everything else. It's like you have to harvest it, but, you know. Oh my god, guys, check this out. A named smelter. I just need to keep her stun locked, otherwise she's gonna just beat the crap out of me. I was able to clear out everything else in the camp. But this is the first, like, really good one I've seen over here, dude. A sm and a smelter is big, too, because that makes it... Wait, I think this uh, this one will make it like 200% faster or something. I was able to get this guy to stop and wait. I'm starting to learn the commands. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll actually be able to knock some people out after all. This was right next to base. How lucky. This will increase our smelting by so much. And I won't have to make any of the, like, 10 more. What is that? Is that what it's called? Smelters? Whatever they're called. Don't look at me, hyenas. Don't even look. 
We need to get that big wheel, wheel of pain. Oh, I got this whole thing decked out, too. Get on in there. That's awesome. Bet you that's going to take a while. Yeah, I got this whole thing decked out, even the staircase and everything. But it took a while, and it's only a start. I'm going to go clear out the rest of this camp, though. I'm trying to level up my dudes. All right. I've been starting the process of the wall. I've really wanted the wall. So we're going to be working on a lot of stuff at once, but it's fine. It's fine. Um, the castle looks sick, but we need more, like, you know, exterior. There's not enough room there for all of our stuff. We're going to have a lot of animals. A lot of, We're going to need to set up all the stables and all that kind of stuff for taming some horses and whatnot. So we need a lot of space out here. Also, I want, like, the, the big wheel of pain. We need, like, that massive wheel of pain set up somewhere out here. So this is going to be another ongoing process, but I'm going to do it too wide wall making it look like like an actual castle wall it's gonna it's gonna be sick but it's gonna take a long time long time my fighter died my fighter died killing all these dudes but it did knock out a level three archer so we kind of traded a level two fighter for a level three archer i don't know if that's i don't know if it's fair trade but look how many we had to kill, dude. This camp had a lot more than I thought, and they all just charged us, so. <laughs> Need to lose some weight real quick. Rest in peace. Stingin' Fighter t 2. Didn't even have a name. We will remember you. Probably not. I, we won't remember you. What's his name again? Todd? Oh, hello! Claw. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? Claw of Jebel Sog. Okay, hold on, hold on. Don't kill this one. Don't kill this one. We're just gonna hope. We can just. I don't know what's happening, but we're gonna try and knock it out. Hold up, hold up. Dude, come over here. Uh, Kushite fighter. Kushite fighter, bro. Kushite fighter, get over here. I don't know what he's doing. They broke his legs or something. Blacksmith, don't don't mess this up for me, okay? Just don't do it. Oh my god. Oh my god, I got five HP. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Alright, we did it. Claw of Jebel. Is that Jebel? Sog? Get out of the ground. Come here. You're coming with me. Let's get her back. That was a close one. <laughs> that was really close. Okay, so this is insanely, insanely expensive, but I'm doing it. Because I'm sick of having to, like, go down to the river to fill up on water. Or just to get water in general. I mean, it might seem like it's nice having it right there, but it's a lot to go out of the base and down there. Especially when we get another wall around here. So, we're going to make this well. I think it's really big. So, I don't know where we're going to fit it. So, let's see. I can also make some more walls here. So, let's see here. It fills up just with water over time. Okay, that's massive. This is not going in here. This would block my spot. Yeah, it would also block my entire base. All right. It's not going up here. I'm thinking because we're going to have the wall out here. You think it can go over here? Oh, it's not flat enough. I was hoping like it could just kind of like go. Wait, how do we just raise it up and down? No? That's, uh, that looks so nice. Look, at it. it's nice and sandy. Easy to dig out. Okay, I guess we have to place it on, like, flat ground or something. Let's try over here. So, oh, here, yep, yep. We can do it just on, oh, we gotta do it, like, on, uh, sandstone. Alright, let's see here. Where can we put this? Okay, I had to get a lot more foundations down, but it's fine. I plan on doing that around, this around, like, the whole thing anyway. Because I like the even terrain, especially for all the stuff we're going to be putting out here. Like this. But if we put it, like, as close to this wall as possible, that'd be pretty cool. 
It's where they normally have like the big wells and like bathing stuff, right? Like near like the inner castle walls, right? I want to get it like right as close as this, as close to this as possible. Boom! Right there. That's it. I think it, was, I think it was like touching slightly. Okay, that's it. That's it right there. Perfect, dude. This is awesome. Okay, so now we don't have to leave to get water. What do you know? That already sounds like there's water in there somehow. Drink water. Oh, I can drink it as well. Okay, figured we'd go on a little mission. What are these? What is that? It's like a cave up here. Ugh. We've been coming out here. I need to get black ice, so I was trying to come up near the tundra. Because I really want a preserving bin. I don't even know what else, but we need a preserving bin. So we need ice. Like a refrigerator. What? Are there bats? You got this, bro? They don't blow you off the cliff? Claw of Jebel Sag. I, I figured we'd take him out and level him as well, you know. Since they're all done. Oh, by the way, they're all done. Oh, shh. No, 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 no. I'm gonna run out of stam, aren't I? This is embarrassing. Oh, that guy's just falling on down. I guess I'm... I just wanted to harvest this, that's all. Oh, funny seeing you down here. Are you just gonna poke that sheep? What did the sheep do? I'm sorry, mountain goat. You just were murdered. Demon blood. Oh, okay. It's a pretty easy way to farm demon blood. And a lot of XP. Oh, we can get vitality. Yes. Finally. Finally, at this point, we have passive health regen. It's slow, but that's going to change everything, guys. Oh, that. This one's got some form of brain damage. Just walking into a wall. Oh, it's gonna be dark in here, isn't it? This is convenient, though. It is convenient. I will say that. Sorry that you probably can't see much of anything. Uh, neither can I. One sec, I think I have a torch, right? Or I can make a torch? Hey, kill him! I can't see anything. Okay, there's some... Crazy... What? got a cult meeting of bat creatures down here can you can you guys see this because I, okay I can't really see anything I don't want to do this I changed my mind I'm sorry I'm sorry I just I was gonna see if we could sneak past it but apparently that's not gonna happen can my follower take these guys out oh we might be able to win this I'm sorry you guys can't see no, no, it's way too strong. It's way too strong. Oh god. Let's see if we can escape. Go go move towards the light, Chubble Sog. We're not prepared. I'm gonna need some much better weapons and armor. And levels on the follower. No, don't die of dehydration, please. Please don't die of dehydration. Okay, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. I think he should follow me. Why is there happy music playing? This is sad. This is very sad. Oh, we made it. Dude, they followed us all the way out. At least the small ones. So I'm just letting him finish them off since I'm close to death and have no more bandages. Okay, I've been walking around here for a while. I think I might just have to look up where the black ice is. I'm not sure. But what is this? What is this? Oh, a cutscene? Oh, that was me dying. That was a cutscene of me dying. Oh, God. No. Oh, no. That was so far from base. What? No warning? Okay, Jebel. Watch me, bro. Okay, well, that's where we're going to stop for today, I think. I need to make my way all the way back there. You guys enjoy the rest of your day. 
<laughs> Thanks for watching.